Welcome to Swadhyay. Let's learn. In this video, we can learn about nouns and pronouns. You can also answer a few questions to test yourself. Let's get started. Nouns. Nouns are called naming words. Naming words are the names of people, places, animals and things. Let me give you a few more examples. Names of people, name of a person like Ben, Alex, Mia, Mr. Peter and Miss Richard. Or in general, a boy, girl, mother, dad, grandfather, aunt or cousin. Or by profession like a king, queen, teacher, farmer, doctor, chef, pilot. Names of places. Names of specific places like Blake Garden, Golden Gate Bridge, Ambience Mall, Cakewalk Bakery, Woola Lake, New York, Mexico City. Or in general like a house, park, zoo, market, farm, police station, hospital, hall, bank, hotel, church, stadium, or the rooms in your house like kitchen, bedroom, living room, etc. Names of animals like lion, tiger, peacock, elephant, hen, fish, monkey, and the names of their babies. Names of things like flower, ball, cake, cup, table, bed, pencil, toy and many more. These are all nouns. Now identify nouns in the given sentences. Rabbits are eating carrots. Rabbits, the name of an animal, and carrot is a thing. So rabbits and carrots are nouns. The garden is full of beautiful flowers. Garden and flowers are nouns in this sentence. Mr. John is driving his car. Mr. John is the name of a specific person and car is a thing. So Mr. John and car are nouns in this sentence. I'm going to the mall with my friends. Mall and friends are nouns in this sentence. Mom cooks tasty food. Mom and food are nouns. Now let's learn about pronouns. Pronouns are the words which replace the nouns. But why do they replace the nouns? Let's understand it with an example. Alex is a nice boy. Alex is my friend. Alex can swim. Alex can dance too. The name of the boy Alex is repeated in every sentence. To avoid repetition of the same noun over and over, it is replaced with a pronoun. Here, Alex is a boy, so we use the pronoun he to replace the name Alex. Let's take a look at different pronouns. He he is used to talk about a boy or a man. 
she is used to talk about a girl or a woman. It is used to talk about an animal or a thing. I am Ben. I love to play football. I is a pronoun that is used to talk about yourself. You are looking pretty in this dress. You are beautiful. You is used for the person or the persons you are talking to. Here you is a pronoun. We are good friends. We study together. We. We stands for the names of more than one person speaking. It may be girls, boys, men or women. The word we is a pronoun. They played well. They won the match. They. They stands for the names of more than one person, animal or thing that are being talked about. In this example, we are talking about more than one person. Let us look at some examples where they is used for animals and things. Sam gave me a bunch of grapes. They are sour. They. They is a pronoun here. They represents grapes, which is a noun. Tom, Gracie and Bash are my pet dogs. They are friendly. Tom, Gracie and Bash are the names of pet dogs which are replaced by they. They is a pronoun. These are the pronouns we learned in this video. I, you, he, she, it, we and they. Now let's do a simple exercise to check what you understood about pronouns. Identify pronouns in the given sentences. She gave me a book. She is a pronoun. They enjoyed the party. They is a pronoun. He is watering the plants. Here he is a pronoun. I am eating an apple. I is a pronoun in this sentence. It is an old car. It is a pronoun. We are going on a trip. We is a pronoun in this sentence. Well, this is a very simple activity. Come back to the channel to take the English grammar challenge on nouns and pronouns. Let's see if you can score 10 on 10. If you like this video, subscribe, like and share Swadhyay. Don't forget to press the bell icon. Thank you.